Hi there, my name is Raymond Sharp, and I want to show you a uh, slightly hidden feature inside of JS Bin. Um, now, uh, I use GitHub for a bunch of my code, and I use GIST to save little bits of, uh, of code. And one of the things you can do in a GIST is save both the HTML and uh, the JavaScript to separate files here. So here's one example. I've got the uh, the JavaScript and the HTML. If I want to go and test this in JSB, and I could copy and paste it and download it and paste it in. But what I can also do is um, just on the JSB URL, I'll just put gist and then the ID of the gist. So there should be a bookmark clip for this, but if I get rid of the uh, S on HTTP, change it to jsbin.com slash gist and then the ID, hit enter, um, it's gone off and loaded that gist straight into the browser. Now I can preview that and it's actually going to run that code for me. Um, so what it does is it looks for the first JavaScript file and puts it in the JavaScript tab and it looks for the first HTML file and puts an HTML tab. In this example, uh, I've got a gist with just JavaScript. If I just stick that into uh, JS bin, uh, there we go, it just swaps in the JavaScript but not the HTML. Pretty straightforward. Um, maybe someone wants to write a bookmark for it and I'll add it into the help or even to this, uh, this uh, screencast. Otherwise, um, thanks for watching. Cheers. Bye.